talk about it. Man. Damn. Yeah. Yeah. Ain't that shit hard as fuck? That yeah. shit is hard, dude. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I love that joint right there, man. Shit. Hey, somebody asked me what I'm drinking. What are you drinking, what man? Virus, nigga. What? <laughs> he cut us off. He cut himself off the drink. Say it again. <laughs> Ask me again. What? Ask me again. No, man. All right, what are you what? drinking? <laughs> <laughs> no, already I'm, get I'm, happy. You know, you know, silly. Uh, shouts to Nari, who who introduced y'all to the nasty. The nasty. Yeah. I'm gonna introduce y'all to the delish. <laughs> Uh, what, the, what is that, though? This is those angry pirates there, son. Oh, okay. Yeah, oh. Show them the recipe. This yeah. is the most simple, best tasting yeah. shit. We should fucking start a segment for recipes. Go ahead. We're teaching people how to get say, drunk. Nigga? White nigga? <laughs> Did you say uh, a, a recipe section of the Hood Hype Show? Yes, sir. Are you April Fool in these fuckers? A drink recipe. Oh, man. Six, this nah. nigga. Well, Shit. first you must mince the meat. Drink recipe. <laughs> drink recipe. First you must mince the meat. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't gonna front, man. I no. mean, I got some low budget recipes for your ass, man. I mean, Burnett's, just drink it. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Burnett's glass, no. that is all. This right here, sir. This right That's here, sir. Up. This is that uh, that you know. You get you a you get you a pint, a captain. And I stopped at the uh, the, the it's supposed bougie. to be lime, I, though, I stopped right? Stopped at a bougie. 7-Eleven to get my liquor that didn't even have the real lime shit. You yeah, know? 7-Elevens are the are the Michigan bodega. Go oh, ahead. Yeah, go. Yeah, stop at the bodega. You ain't even got to pull your ass out and show them your black ass or nothing like that. Actually, now, I don't know. It's 7-Eleven. I thought they was nationwide. Or oh, they is, are. Are, are they? Yeah. Are? yeah. What's okay. that? No, they're nationwide. They're yeah, nationwide. yeah, yeah. But I mean, oh, okay. they ain't everywhere. They're not everywhere? I, they can't be everywhere. So that's that shit. Sometimes I get right. stuck in right. what we see every day. Stanville. Yeah, yeah. Actually. Yeah. Nah, but I stopped at the, uh, the bougie 7-Eleven bodega and shit. And shit. And uh, they did not have the limes. And they, 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 no, you got to get real limes. I'm, saying, man, I'm trying to make a drink off of it. They I told you to get real limes. Yeah, I was like, no, man, I'm trying to make a drink off of it. What type of that. rich nigga shit yeah, that they on? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, we want the shit Why in don't the you buy bottle, 60, motherfucker. Why don't you, yeah. you buy 60 limes so you can make your little punk <laughs> drink, nigga? Flow man. Ain't that, man, that's some rich shit, ain't it? Yeah. You so, need to buy real limes. <laughs> get the fuck out of here. I want this shit in a plastic container. <laughs> Give me like a booty. Like, exactly, like a man. Give me that. I want the fucking quarter water. Flow man. Ah. Shit. What's popping, baby? Oh, man. I just want y'all to know. <laughs> from the get-go, I know y'all was full of shit. I just... <laughs> you did. You posted that shit on the blog immediately. You did, too, you hater. You could have kept it quiet, man. Yeah. 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 He was like, this man, shit's you know, suspect. You know, this ain't for Fool's Day, man. My doctor could tell me I had cancer, and I wouldn't believe it. <laughs> right. Oh, I you know, feel you. That's how I feel bad. But uh, on the Twitter beef shit, that's what y'all talking about today, right? Yes, sir. Yeah, I mean, you know, basically, the problem with Twitter beef is... Because of all the social networking shit, motherfuckers have gotten to shut the fuck up. <laughs> you know, um, I mean, there's a reason why your thoughts are private and in your head. You know what I'm saying? It takes effort to communicate that. And the problem with Twitter is, from a cell phone, computer, what the fuck ever, you can put your thoughts out there at any given time. Well, some thoughts just need to stay in your motherfucking head. Right. So, hold on, hold on, no flow. So that's the argument, though, because some fans want to know what their favorite artist is thinking every second of the day. You don't, you don't want to know? You well, you know, I told, I told females I've dated that I wanted to know what they were thinking, and ultimately, when they let me know what they were thinking, I didn't want to know that shit. Right. Uh, uh, you was getting them, and then you were done, and you didn't care. Yeah. I feel you. I feel you. You know, and so that's just the main problem. You know, motherfuckers <laughs> just need to shut the fuck up, because all this beef is unnecessary. They beefing over... He said something about me. Shut the fuck up and keep rapping, you know? <laughs> Man. So I, I'll file you under corny then. All right, I got you. I, I got you. Yeah, I no, feel he, the same he way. Oh, yeah. Yeah, 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 not, not saying you're corny. No, he's talking about the the, yeah, yeah, the whole Twitter bitch. Hey, corny. you corny nigga. <laughs> <laughs> that Twitter shit corny as fuck. You're so now, dick, now hold on though, but like, let's go this way though. As far as you said, people with their random thoughts, right. sometimes they need to shut up. But what if you have a legitimate problem? Because the Fonte and Knife Wonder shit, that's, that's some real... Issues between two dudes on that Twitter? used to be friends. Yeah, and they addressing it on Twitter. On Twitter? Yeah. What? On <laughs> Twitter? Huh? Yeah, exactly. Like, I don't know, man. I don't that's know. This shit, that's, that's, if I got a problem, if, if me and you is like boys from way back in the day, baby, I'm not going to put this shit out there on exactly. Twitter. Exactly. Thank you. All right. This is, this is, we men. We men. No we talk, doubt. We talk to men, men to men. You know, exactly. There's, there's a reason right. everybody knows the phrase "man to man" is because you go talk to a man to his face if you, if you especially if you know the if you, and that's your dude. Yeah. yeah. So I, yeah, I'm with, I just had to play devil's advocate okay. for a All minute. Right. I had that, to do that's that. where yeah, this whole fun All right, Flo, man. Appreciate good it, good luck, bro. Baby. All right, man. All right, man. Yeah. Be easy. 
I like Flo Man because his name rhymes with mine. <laughs> Pro Man. Uh, hey, this is where the Fonte shit plays right into it. Yeah, because that's what he said. He was like, dude, talk to me. And then the funniest part, though, was they, the conversation where he said, you know, let's meet at the studio, man. We got some shit we got to iron out. And Knife was like, he said, Knife swallowed his chest up. was like, why don't we do it at your house? <laughs> and Fonte was like, all right. He was like, <laughs> he's like, if you want to come on, I'll clean up the house and straighten up the living room and get everything straight. Get some mince meat And then on he the said table. he was waiting for him to come. And then he said about 25 minutes later, Knife called up and was like, Yo, man, we can't just do this over the phone and, and um, go ahead and do this. We we'll talk it out. And then he said that was just. He said he lost all all respect <laughs> at that point. Like, you, I was trying to do somewhere neutral at the studio where everybody got you know everybody go there. Right. You want to get brolic and talk about let's meet at my house. And then when push come to shove, you was like you know let let's talk. We we'll talk over the phone. And then you know he said you know we boys, man. He said we came into the industry together. You at least owe me a face to face conversation a, so I, I agree you know what i'm saying so yeah but but even if they just went to the crib and went you know went to that that room in the basement and just you know like all right well we, this didn't work let's go to the other room in the basement where it's you know where you know it's no sharp corners and no, no, no weapons and shit let's get it on fuck it that's how i feel I, it's, it's come to that with me where if we were ready to do it like I, this is what it is let's get in the car let's go and it, it, it's no homo stuff. Yeah. It's going to be some straight, like, homo, like, knock your ass homo uh, the fuck out. That's that's what it's going to be. One of us is going to get knocked out. Yeah. Or, or it's going to be a real good fight. That's yeah. how it's going to be. That or you talking about artistic motherfuckers, though. So, and I, I'm, I'm getting this <laughs> from true. Fonte's that's true. point. He's saying, like, he's ready to go. That's true. He's like, look, we meet face to face. We say what we got to say. And it's either going to be good going forward or it's going to be bad or not, not on no Twitter, indifferent. Though. So not, we'll see, man. I don't know Twitter, though. You, I, I. I, I'm thinking Twitter's gay. I'm, I'm about to start saying Twitter's gay, man. They ain't cutting me no check. I, I'm fucking. You ain't me. feeling it. No. Why? Why? Oh, man, I don't even. All right. No, go ahead. Did you just say why? What, what the fuck is wrong? You with looking Twitter? at a Twitter junkie? He right. likes Twitter because I don't give a fuck what you're doing. I don't, I don't. It ain't about what I'm doing. Hold on. I'm you sorry. want me to go I'm in? Sorry. I'm all right. Hold on. Nate just heard this. Hold on. Let's time. pause Did it. You not just you, ask me you, why. You make no, yeah. He just but asked me why. He's got a good. I don't care. He asked me why. I didn't even get to explain it. Okay, can we explain it? I will retort. On the comeback. Okay. And then I will retort your ass. <laughs> in the other room in this basement, motherfucker. Y'all peep this shit yet, man? That B.O.B. The T.I.M. Playboy. This shit hot. Man, thanks for the night. 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 Man, thanks for the night.